How's it going YouTube Infusion? This is Linux215 with another one of my tutorials and guides. This one will be on getting rid of uh, viruses and spyware and all that good gravy stuff. So first off, go ahead and download the AVG free from my guide on PS3 T-Fusion. And once you've done that, go ahead and start it up. Okay, it's best to do all this stuff in safe mode and for it's different for each person how to get into safe mode. But on the boot screen, in, on your splash screen where it says press whatever button to go into BIOS or whatever, press the corresponding button for your computer to bring up that menu and go into safe mode. And that is the best way to do it because that way you know, the viruses are running and all that good stuff. Okay, so first off what you're going to want to do on this one is go ahead and scan the uh, whole computer. Another little bonus about that is you can st scan uh, personal little files and everything to see if that particular file you downloaded has a virus and all that other good stuff. It's a great little program and it's complete 100% free. So, um, so yeah, as you can see it's scanning and everything is fine so far. But uh, if you have any problems right here it will pop up this virus found and all that stuff. Well this takes a minute so I'm going to go ahead and pause this so or pause the video and come back to when it's done and show you guys the rest so that way it keeps it short for the YouTube video. Alright uh, guys, I'll be back in a minute, and uh, take care. Alright guys, I'm back. Alright, the scan has completely finished. I can tell there was no infections found, but uh, say if you did have an infection and it was found, uh, you'd be able to vault it and put it into vault, and then access your vault and delete it. Okay, say you did find a virus here, and uh, the vault thing is good and everything, but after that, uh, I like to go ahead and close that up. And I like to start up search and destroy. And th this is, it finds all the spyware, all the adware, just anything bad on your computer, any kind of virus at all, and it will just destroy it. Search it out and destroy it. Yeah, I've used it for years upon years. It's, it's a great anti spyware. And uh, I suggest you guys pick it up and use it. I run it every once a week just to make sure and keep everything up to date. Okay, now once your spyware is up, you can do quite a few things. You can recover, say you do something, you mess up somehow, which is pretty hard to do. You can recover it, all your last changes that you delete, if you accidentally delete something that you shouldn't have. But you can immunize, uh, you can immunize all your stuff and make sure no viruses can infect the stuff that's already on your computer. And that's a pretty good nifty little feature of it. It's good to do it every once in a while, probably every time you run this. And then you go ahead and search and destroy. Now this will go ahead and search your computer, every file on it, and find anything that shouldn't be there, wrong, fix registry errors. It's just a gr all around great program to have. And um, it varies on the time, on how much files you got and all that good stuff. But like I said, it's best to do it in safe mode because that way none of the viruses are active because some stop uh, spywares like this to stop the stuff from running and we don't want that so go ahead and start up in uh, safe mode it varies for each computer you can go ahead and google that or something and um, I don't know why this is taking so long to start up probably because I'm running my deboot uh oh Now once this is all the way done and running, it will f tell you what it's found and ask you if you want to get rid of it and all that stuff. Look through it, make sure it's stuff that shouldn't be on your computer, and if it isn't, go ahead and delete it. Um, I'll go ahead and pause this for a minute and let come back and show you guys the end result. Okay guys, welcome back. Uh, I'm back with the end result, and as you can tell, something has slipped by me and got onto my computer. Okay, I'm kind of glad it did, so it gives me something to actually show you guys what to do. Okay, after you found something that's checked, go ahead and click Fix Selected Problem. Are you sure you want to remove these entries? Yes. One problem fixed. 
Okay, now let's check mark. Now that problem's fixed. Okay. Now say it was something on your computer that you needed for some reason and it picked it up as uh, being something wrong. You can go ahead and come over here to recovery and find what it was and put it back right back on. But after that's done, you can go ahead and X out of it and uh, restart your computer. And everything should be good after that and there should be no problems at all. And I uh, hope you guys liked it and stay tuned for more of my tutorials and guides and uh, come check out PS3T Fusion and uh, tell me what you like and see if uh, there's anything else on there we can help you with. Later guys, you have a good day.